That's the one. Good man. It's been a while since we've used this. So today, today, actually today, it is, uh, it's about uh, 420, is it? 420, and we are going to pick up LG and D32. Another package, what is this? Dark. It's my wall mount power washer. Oh yeah it is. Retractable reel. Every single one of these thin packages is a neon sign. A million packages. As I was saying, we get sidetracked real easy. I gotta get my BMW key. Did you lock it? Yes, you did. We are going to pick up LG 32 It's a 2022 Denali. Is it 2500 or 3500? 2500. 2500. Black. Now, we had a few people ask, why did you buy a white high country? Because a lot of people know that when we wrap a truck, I plan to get a black truck. So it was unusual to see a white truck get wrapped. Very unusual, right? Um, why did I do that? Well, that truck specifically was gonna get wrapped in orange and white, right? Well, all the white pieces that you see on the outside of the truck are painted. So that way, if somebody were to wanna take off the wrap, the parts are white and not black, right? So it kind of just worked with the theme. Obviously, you see white door jams. It's not that big of an issue. Again, if anybody ever wants to take off that wrap in the future, there are a lot of parts that are painted white. Granted, there's some parts that are painted orange as well, so they'd have to get repainted anyways. But since we were doing orange and white, it made sense. It doesn't really matter if it's black or not. And again, sometimes there's, a, there's cases where you can't find a black truck. Like, for instance, the Ram. Everybody's whining and moaning about how we're not keeping the blue truck blue. Now, if we had planned to do a blue truck, it would have been awesome, obviously, but we didn't plan to do a blue truck. We planned to do a green truck. So we couldn't find a black truck. That dark blue wasn't too far off, and we were gonna settle for that, whatever we can get. I mean, at the end of the day, if it was white, we would really rather not white, but couldn't find black. We needed a limited Longhorn, and the only one that was available in the whole entire country was that one. So again, deal with what you get. But if we have the choice, if we have the option, and if there is stock available, and we want to wrap the vehicle, usually it's gonna be black. So with that said, this truck that we're picking up today is going to get wrapped. It's a black vehicle and it's gonna be the first chrome truck that we've done in a long time. So remember we did, uh, we did the red chrome Cummins, we did the teal chrome Cummins, we did the orange chrome Cummins, and then we did the, uh, the normal just chrome wrapped Denali. So we've done a lot of chrome. It's been a while since we've done chrome. The last one was number 24, giveaway number 24. Now we're on 32. So eight giveaways ago, we did another chrome truck. That was the last time. So we were due for another chrome truck, and this thing, I'm telling you, this purple wrap, I mean, you guys saw it. The purple wrap is badass. So with that said, let's go pick up this truck. It's an hour away, it's in Torrington. Hey Robert, this is John. Hey John. Hey, we're uh, on our way right now. We're still like 25 minutes away. We got jammed up in traffic. All right, get here as soon as you get there. Yep, sounds good. Right. We'll yep. see you there. All right. They always look good with uh, chrome on them. Good, how we doing? Oh, late. That's all right. We're all set. That's it? That's it. All right. Truck is yours, you're ready to go. All awesome. right, guys. Hey, thank you. All right. Thank you very much. Black on black. First time we've ever had that happen. Wow. That's kind of cool. Huh? That is kind of cool. I keep that, I wear that as a chain. Yes, sir. Oh, you guys see the inside? Now you don't, because there's nothing new to see about it. And well, you can still digital? see it because there's have no... the digital uh, review. Okay. Okay. <laughs> should we leave? Should off. we leave that here and see if anybody can find it? Be like we, we hit. If they can find it. Once yeah, this video we gets posted. Yeah, hey, no, we're at Hogan that. Cider Mill in Burlington, they Connecticut. Cider donuts? Yeah. Oh, this is the. Oh. On the way out, Gio. We're at the sweet back. <laughs> <laughs> this is giving off such good views. Yeah. Is it? Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, three supercharged. Okay. Hell yeah. Supercharged. Yup. Supercharged with no plate. So 
donuts. Oh, thank you so much. These look You're welcome. Oh. Enjoy. Oh man, where does this go? Do wow. people inside or mouth? People spill these. Are the uh, donuts hot? No, they sh shouldn't be. <laughs> no, they shouldn't be. <laughs> no, I mean. No, not hot. Oh, that's like, delicious. Warm. They really are cold. at the beginning of the day, but right now they've been like they're chilling cold. for a while. Hard. Yeah, they're a bit cooler. I mean, they're in trays, but careful. This is delicious. Lost their heat throughout the day. No, these probably get moved every day. Put it right here. Wow. Hey, bail. Here we go. Hogan's Cider Mill, I Connecticut, Burlington. It's hiding behind that hay bale. Oh <laughs> Owen just said he wants the uh, the antenna from this truck for an ad. He does. Yeah. It's gonna be a, like a wand or something. We'll see. Hey, Sam. Owen said he wants the antenna for an ad. Crazy. <laughs> you look like uh like you're about to rob somebody out here. Yeah, I do. I just walked up, stole the antenna back. So super sad because we wanted to go to J. Timothy's, a super, super, super good spot for wings and all things like American food. And um, we've resorted to getting uh, yummy sushi. Half a mile down the road because all right, squid, pipe down. Down the road from this place because we're starving and we can't drive any further. And it's 7:30 before Halloween, so I don't even have a Halloween costume, but we're probably gonna do something tonight. But it's 7:30, so we'll see you guys after food. We're gonna enjoy it. That was a quick turn down. Walk in. <laughs> Dumbass is that? And it's cold. I mean, it's get out for. It's one of those places nothing. with just the counter when you walk in, and there's no seats. Shit. Nice way work your magic on that. Yo, you. Now what have we come to? We have arrived. Mikado. Different sushi spot. This is like Classic 15 minutes joint. from my house, so it's like. We drove another 15 minutes to get here. 20. It's also mm, But we my arrived favorite. the best, John's favorite sushi place. Oh, the antenna. We both dropped something. No way again, dude, the antenna. It doesn't have power stuffs. Shout out North West Hills. All right, so we ended up getting food at Mikado. I don't know, it's like nine o'clock now. Have the truck back, safe and sound. No plate. Made it safe. We have one of every model. Well, we're missing the Ram, but right now we have one of every model at the moment. The F450, all 2022s. 2022 F450, 2022 High Country, 3500, 2022 Denali, 2500, and then 2022 Ram, 3500, Limited Longhorn. So the Ram is pretty much done. You should be seeing this video after the, um, the, the final build vlog for the Ram, I believe. Oh I'm not 100% sure when this video is going up. But the green Ram is pretty much done at this point in time. So you guys will or should have seen that already. And this thing right here is going to come apart soon. Hopefully this is the first truck that we build inside the lab. I'm not 100% sure when exactly we can start actually working in there because the lifts need to get delivered the floors need to get done and all i want all the paint done before i actually start working in there um i'm saying like we could build this without being able to take customers in yet letting people walk in we could still build the giveaway trucks just like we do now without doors open to anyone so as soon as we can get in there like as soon as we are physically able to the second that the floor is done the second that there's not any commotion going on around a lift we are gonna start working on there, and hopefully it's for this truck right here, or maybe even we could take it over in the middle of the process. I don't know, we'll figure it out. But I hope it is this one. It's gonna be sick. We have a cool color, obviously, and um, it's gonna be different. Something that we haven't done in a long time. We'll explain more in the build vlog, because that is going to come up very soon. So anyways, we are going to enjoy the rest of our night. We have a 2022 Denali 2500 bought and about to be in the works, so if you wanna see that thing all done up, Subscribe. Oh, and might as well throw in a quick PSA. If you have not entered to win the 2022 High Country 3500 wrapped in orange with all white accents, it's kind of hard to see right now. Actually, what I can do here is 
Uh-huh, uh-huh, orange steps. Okay, so if you don't follow LGND um, on YouTube or Instagram or me on Instagram, and this is your first time seeing a video, well, we give away trucks, and this will be a giveaway truck. This is a giveaway truck currently. So this is the current giveaway. It doesn't end on Halloween day, you might think, because it's orange, but it doesn't end on Halloween day. So if you're watching this after Halloween, you might still have time. The deadline's November 11th, 2022. So if you haven't gotten entered to win this thing, there's not much time left. Somebody literally wins every single time we do a giveaway. It could be you on this one, but if you don't get entered, you will not. So now with that said, if you want that thing, click the link. If not, end the video, go to bed, enjoy the rest of your day, whatever. I'll see you next vlog.